In response to flash flooding earlier this week, Pike County Emergency Management Services spoke with Mountaintop about damage and safety Wednesday. Flash flooding that occurred Monday over in the McCarr Ransom area of uh, Blackberry. Uh, got a number of homes that received water damage, some more extensive than others. We had a couple of homes that had been destroyed. Uh, one of them was destroyed by a mudslide that knocked it off its foundation. Uh, and then there's some older trailers, mobile homes that got water in them that we count as destroyed because of their age uh, and the damage they sustained as well. But uh, over the most part of it, there's a few major damaged uh, homes and mostly minor damage from water. Here at Pikeville Medical Center's Heart and Vascular Institute, we have assembled a comprehensive team of cardiac specialists bringing expertise from all regions of the nation and the world. We have coupled that with cutting edge technology, providing them the best equipment and operating rooms available. The result is comprehensive cardiac care for the people of our region that is second to none. The Heart and Vascular Institute at Pikeville Medical Center. Tackett adds that some residents remain isolated after flooding removed access to homes and that crews are working to repair those entrances. Well, I don't know of any right now. I know there's a couple of places. I think it's Calf Branch at Blackberry and Dials Branch at Blackberry. They're having to just about rebuild some of the road back in there, putting drains and stuff back in so they can get people out. If you're traveling and the water's over the roadways, don't drive into the water. Turn around, don't drown, because we've had a numerous first responders have to put their lives at risk to rescue people trapped in water because they drove into it. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Forgel.